So welcome, welcome, welcome. We are going to do something, and I hope it turns out. I hope it's not a fail. We'll see. Um, I am recreating this from somebody else I've seen do it. I feel like my phone is still not right. Oh, I might have to go in there and take his hot dog away. He's messed me up. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. Here we go, here we go. So, what I've done is took some poster board, just regular white poster board, because I couldn't find red or green. And I just, I cut a little bit off of it, and I rolled it to resemble somewhat of a Christmas tree, but, you know, it's gonna look better after I get the strawberries on it. So, and I've got some milk chocolate. You can buy whatever milk chocolate you want. This is the kind they use for, like, the chocolate fountains you find in the wedding section at Walmart. Um, they're not that expensive. Dare you to go rip his hot dog off his plate? <laughs> no, he ain't been that mean. So I'm going to throw this in the microwave for um, a minute just to see what it does. That may not be long enough and that's okay. Let me get, would y'all please lock and share? Hannah, you're so crazy. <laughs> Gracie, Hannah. Thank y'all so much. Now, what I have done, let me get my strawberries out. Y'all have been planning to do this for three days. Three days. I've already washed and cut the tops off of my strawberries. Baby. My babies got into them last night when they came to visit. They loved them. Oh, they loved them so much. And then the tops of the strawberries I've just got in another bowl. I'm going to use that to stick in, um, you know, just to make leaves or whatever. Um, and I've got, I thought about since I've got it on this uh, Christmas platter, I thought I'd take some little marshmallows and just scatter around it to look like snow later on. And then I've got powdered sugar to sprinkle on the strawberries, you know, at the end. But we're going to dip it in chocolate and hope that sticks. <laughs> and hope it sticks. I probably should have got some toothpicks, but the girl that I seen do it, that I'm recreating it from, did not use toothpicks. She just used this chocolate and, you know, it stuck. So, because of course the chocolate will harden. So, so that was just a minute. I'm gonna put it in there for another minute. It melts really good. Oh my gosh, y'all, it smells so good. I want to lick the spoon. Hey, Marie Teal. Hey, everybody. Thank y'all so much for joining. I'm melting my chocolate. I know I've missed everybody because I've been trying to, you know, fix stuff back. <laughs> but hello, everybody. Thanks for joining. Hey, Chris. Hey, Christy. Hey, Rebecca. Hey, everybody I've missed. Hey, Kathy Runyon. Whoo! Now, lousy day. Huh, now I'm out of breath. I'm just waiting on my chocolate. So once the uh, chocolate melts, we're going to stick the strawberries. And I've washed my hands already. Don't worry about it. Hey, hey! I'm going to dip the strawberries in the chocolate, and we're going to start at the bottom. I'm going to use the um, big strawberries first, you know, and go up by size. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and actually spread some of the mini marshmallows around the bottom where I've glued it to this. Um, I glued it to parchment paper and then onto this platter. Hey, Jamie. It's just uh, poster board. It's just poster board. I should have made it a little more, <laughs> a little better, but I tried. <laughs> It needs to resemble a Christmas tree, Miss Marcia. Um, and mine will a little bit better after the strawberries are on it because I'm going to use, um, you know, the strawberries by size. So I'm hoping at the end, I'm recreating this from um, another girl I saw do it. So I hope mine looks as good as hers. Hers looks really good. So we're going to see. But I'm going to go ahead and scatter some of the mini marshmallows around the bottom where I've glued it to the parchment paper so you don't see that glue. Hello, everybody. Please like and share hashtag strawberry. We're going to do a strawberry Christmas tree. If anybody's having a Christmas party this weekend or next weekend, you've got till next Monday, <laughs> this would be great. Um, people can just come by and snatch off a strawberry. I've got another. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Rich said I 
I worded that funny. They're going to grab a strawberry. <laughs> so anyway, the mini marshmallows are made to resemble snow. I'm going to put more um, down in a little bit, but for now, I just wanted to cover up that bottom part of the tree. I'm not going to put strawberries down there because of the, you know, the hot glue is down there. So this will cover that. All right. So again, this is um, a piece of cardboard and I've put wax paper or parchment paper around it. So the strawberries will go on the parchment paper. <sighs> I'm so nervous about this. <laughs> I hope it turns out. Let's, oh, this bowl is hot. Y'all let me get a towel. I don't have a whole lot of space to work in, but this bowl of chocolate I have in the microwave is hot, 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 hot. <laughs> so let's give it a stir. Let's get that over and see what we got here. Oh my gosh. Y'all, this melts so good. Is it edible afterwards or it is edible? Yes, it's going to be chocolate covered strawberries. It is edible. Yeah. Um, this up carbon. here, yeah, don't eat the carbon. <laughs> um, up here is taped with like scotch tape. Um, I just used hot glue at the bottom so it would stay on my platter. Um, but the rest of this is scotch tape. No yep, scotch tape. No so, honey, would you hush? He's going to make me get him again. He will not shut up. Don't eat the scotch tape. I think everybody knows not to eat the scotch tape. <laughs> oh, Lord, I'm going to beat him before the night's over. All right, y'all, this melts so good. Like I said, again, this is um, the chocolate that you find in your um, wedding aisle at Walmart. It's the kind you used for, like, chocolate fountains. You know what I'm saying? It melts so good. You can use any kind you want. You can get the... Uh, just the chocolate chips or whatever. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna beat him. The bowl is kinda hot. So, this is melting really good. I'm not gonna put it back in the microwave because it's just about melted. If I just keep stirring it a little bit, it'll go ahead and melt. I don't want it so hot that it's not gonna stick to the poster board or the, you know, the wax paper. I do want it to um, start cooling down that way It'll harden and stick to the, the thing. <laughs> the thing, whatever. <laughs> and then after this, I've got another thing we're going to do. You guys have probably seen it before. Um, I'm going to turn this light off behind me. I didn't realize in this video that there's such a glare right here. I apologize. Let me fix that. Let me turn this off. I had it off. There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, so again, we are making a strawberry edible Christmas tree. Everything on it is edible. It's going to be chocolate-covered strawberries. And then, um, like I said, I just took the tops off the strawberries, and it's going to go, you know, like in between certain spots. That way you don't see the white. Um, let me ask y'all this. Should I paint this with chocolate? So you don't see the white in between the strawberries because I don't have enough you know leaves to go all over it I don't think should I paint this chocolate that way it's all chocolate give me some give me some feedback what do y'all think yes okay um okay hold on Okay, yes, all right, that's what I'm gonna do then. I'm gonna go ahead and start painting my cone. Hey, Tracy too, thanks for joining. Well, um, you can if you want. This is just for me and my family. I'm not having a party or nothing. Um, if I was having a party, I would maybe use gloves or at least wash your hands. <laughs> I did wash my hands earlier, um, so I'm not gonna use gloves for it just being us. You know, <laughs> so, um, but you, you can, if you want, um, 
But again, since it's just for, you know, just for us, I'm not going to. I'm just going to go barehanded. <laughs> Woo, this chocolate melts so good, y'all. Look at that. Oh, mercy. All right. Well, I probably need something other than this knife. I don't know if it's going to take me forever to use this knife. Hold on. I wish I had a paintbrush that hadn't been used. You know what I'm saying? I just thought it would be easier to put on. Oh, Kathy. I thought you meant just to do the. <gasps> That's a good idea. Shut the front door. I don't have any. I don't have. Oh, man. That would have been a great idea. I didn't think about painting the cone till just now. <laughs> Butter brush. Okay, let me try that. Yeah, because that's going to take forever. Kathy, I'm sorry. You know, girl. You know I misunderstand all the time. <laughs> um, let's see. <gasps> I got one. I got one. Yeah, yeah. Check it out. Got it. Thank y'all. I didn't even think of that. Okay, here we go. We're going to brush this thing. <laughs> Kathy, honey, you know me. <laughs> you know me so good. All right. Oh, so we're going to do some painting. And, oh, my gosh, this is fun. <laughs> Kathy. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Hey, I'm just glad you still love me. <laughs> as ditzy as I am. And I know. Hey, I know. I know I am. <laughs> All right, here we go. <gasps> what? No. Not supposed to. Y'all, let me uh, change phones for my charger. Hold on a second. This phone's going dead, of course, already. But I've got my charger in now. Well, <laughs> all right, so let's keep a painting. Oh my gosh, look at that. I could just lick it. <laughs> it's like a chocolate fountain. Well, chocolate cone, of course, but y'all, man. Thank y'all for joining. If you would like and share, I would greatly appreciate it. We are making a strawberry Christmas tree it is edible and um, I'm just I just come up with the um, thought which I should have thought about it earlier to um, paint my cylinder or whatever this is called <laughs> um, with chocolate so you don't see the white poking through the strawberries so I could have already had this part done but well I'm picking up a few of the marshmallows but that's okay <laughs> thank you Kathy All right, here we go. I believe we about got all of it cut. Well, not yet. Almost. Go down as far as you can at the bottom. Ooh, this is going to be good, y'all. Hello, everybody. Thanks for joining. We're making a strawberry Christmas tree for your Christmas party. If anybody's having one, or if you just want to do it. I know me and Rich um, talked about, we're just going to do, um, hey everybody, we're just going to do snack food for Christmas, because you know, we just had the turkey and all that for Thanksgiving, so we're just going to do... Um, snack food for Christmas. I'm going to make some, you know, like sausage balls, pigs in the blanket, chips and dip, maybe, you know, whatever. So, if you're doing this just for y'all at your house and not having a party, you can still do this. I know my family loves strawberries. Um, so, they'll just go by and pick off a strawberry. Okay, so we've got our cone painted. Hey, everybody. Alright, now... 
here's the part I'm kind of worried about. I just, <laughs> all right, so I've got my uh, strawberries already washed and cut up, and I used the tops in another bowl to use, you know, in between the strawberries to make it look, you know, a little bit decorative. So, I really need this right here, I think. So, I'm going to try to start with the biggest strawberries on the bottom. Thank y'all so much. Oh, I don't mean to keep hitting the table, but I don't have a whole lot of room, so. <laughs> All right, got to work with what I got. So, here we go. Ooh, I'm nervous about this. I just hope it works. Hope it works. Well, that was stuck. Okay. So, here we go. Here's a big strawberry, and again, I've just cut the tops off, and I'm going to, hey, everybody, thanks for joining, and I'm just going to dip the, you know, however much of the strawberry you want to be chocolate. I do, too, Kathy Runyon. I do, too, and it may need to be that the chocolate is a little bit more cooler than it is before it holds, but that girl um, that I'm recreating it from, it took her a minute, but once she got going, it was so pretty. So, I'm just blowing the chocolate a little bit so it um, hardens a little bit. All right. Here we go. So, we're just going to hold it for a minute. Plus, those mini marshmallows down there is going to hold it up. Um, might need to use styrofoam next time. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. That girl's held up, and she done it exactly like I'm doing I'm doing it exactly the way she did. She used the poster board and the wax paper and just the chocolate, and it held pretty good. See, that chocolate is hardening and it's holding. Um, yeah, I thought about getting toothpicks because, you know, mine will probably be an epic fail. <laughs> you know how my luck is. Let me turn this um, thing around just a little. Just a little. <gasps> of course. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Okay. <laughs> no, it won't. I hope not. Okay, so there's one down. One down. Here's another big one. Like I said, I'm just going by size. And you can dip the whole strawberry if you want or just a little bit of it. Hello, girlfriend. Oh, no, Kathy. I know, girl. No. No, that don't offend me at all. I love suggestions. I'm just hoping because hers work. I'm hoping mine does. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Okay, here's the next one. We will see. What's everybody doing tonight? Friday night. I hate that on my other phone you can't really see what's going on. Y'all, I apologize, but I am just gluing the strawberries on with chocolate. <laughs> hey, baby doll. What are you doing, girlfriend? No, Lord, that don't offend me at all. I love it. Okay, so there's that one. And you know, I did see, <laughs> watching me, I love y'all. I did see on Pinterest, um, that you could do this with, like, um, wrapped candies, like Hershey Kisses, or, I mean, anything, little Reese Cups. You can do it with anything. You can um, either use a toothpick or hot glue them still in the wrapper onto this. Um, but I liked how she done it with the strawberries. It was so pretty. We'll see. <laughs> Tracy Hunt, you hush your mouth, girl. <laughs> I love you. Why are you feeding it for, honey? I love you so good. I'm good, Rebecca. Lord, I was so worried I couldn't see. And see, that was the real reason that Rich was trying to help me and I got aggravated. <laughs> it was all my fault. <laughs> he was just trying to help. And I was being a, a bee. Tracy, too. I know you was, girl. I love how we joke with each other. I love you, girlfriend. I still love you. Oh, I still love you too, honey. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Even though you was a this is going to take forever, ain't Even it? Though you was a bee to me. <laughs> he said I was a queen bee to him. What are we going to put on top? You know what? I thought about that. Oh, I love you. Um, the girl used a straw, not a strawberry, but she had a star that she put on top of hers that she bought. 
Uh, and I didn't buy one. So, I wonder what a strawberry would look like. Hannah C. <laughs> what do you know? I don't like any monster. No. Okay, so here we go. Another big strawberry. This is too cute. Oh, thank you, Tracy. It's going to take forever, but afterwards, you'll see. It's going to be so cute. But um, what do y'all think about maybe I'll put greenery. Good idea. There's a big hole right here. <laughs> There's a big hole. I wonder if I could, like, glue it down with maybe a flat piece of strawberry and then put greenery on it to cover that. Maybe? I don't know. I didn't even think about that. Well, until I got home and I was like, oh my gosh, she had a cute star that she used on hers and mine's a big hole. <laughs> mine's a big hole. <sighs> hey, I hope y'all ain't got nothing else to do for the next couple of hours because this is probably going to take a while. <laughs> Not now, it looks like a big foot. <laughs> I know. Andrea, because we was talking sweet to each other. She don't like it. And a leg. Because <laughs> mom and dad was saying love you. Hey, we do love each other. No matter what. <laughs> Alright, so there's another one. Hello, hello. Thank y'all for joining. If you would keep liking and sharing, I would greatly appreciate it. Greatly appreciate it. The babies ate so many of these strawberries last night, y'all. It's funny. I'm glad I have another carton in the fridge. Just in case I need it. <gasps> Lemon slices. Marsha, that would have been a good idea. That would have been a good idea. <laughs> I don't have any. <laughs> Man. They about have to. Andrew, ain't that the truth? <laughs> Makes a bow with fondant. Would be cute on top. <gasps> Linda Moore, that would be a great idea, but I don't have any fondant. I don't have any. Well, I got some chocolate. Look at that. I don't have any. Oh, man. Hey, we'll come up with something together, y'all. We will. I am making a strawberry Christmas tree. It is edible. Um, It's poster board, 33 cents at Walmart. Um, Sorry, I was getting a message. Um, It's just poster board, you know, rolled up to resemble. Did somebody just come in? No, I'm not doing that. Oh. Um, it's rolled up. To resemble, you know, maybe a Christmas tree. <laughs> I could have done a better job. Um, I use scotch tape, so it's still going to be edible. Um, chocolate covered marshmallows. Oh my gosh, Sharon Hilton, that's a good idea too. Make your own bow using ribbon. I don't have any ribbon. <laughs> I ain't got nothing. I ain't got nothing. Oh man. <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all. What am I going to do? Always sucks it. <laughs> well, this one's decided to go all the way down in, so this one's going to be a all the way chocolate. Hold on a second. <laughs> Makes me want to go. <sighs> Saw a glimpse of your husband. Did you? <laughs> He's pretty nice looking. Pretty nice looking. Okay, so let's keep on. Got another strawberry, y'all. My hands are probably going to be chocolate covered by the time we are all the way done. Um, Stick a piece of jewelry on top. Kathy, that's a good idea. Ooh. That would be fancy. Okay, now we're going to start on the other layer, and you're just going to go, like, in between um, the two on the bottom. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. Let me show on this one. I'm just going in between the two to start on the other layer. Sorry, y'all can't see down here. So, again, um, we've got our bottom layer done, and this is just um, poster board. <gasps> that would be a good idea, Kathy Runyon. Hey, Kathy Rowe, we're making an edible. Hey, Pamela, Pamela Clark, what you doing, girl? We're making an edible chocolate-covered strawberry Christmas tree. Um, You can, okay, good, 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 good. Um, 
So I took some poster board. I have chocolate. I just want to lick my fingers so bad. <laughs> I'm not going to, though. Even though this is for us. Um, yes, Kathy, that's a good idea. Oh, wait. Perfect picture centered. Oh, okay. I don't know what I thought you meant. I'm so crazy. <gasps> Kathy Rowe, it's going to be so good. I'm recreating it from somebody else that I saw doing it. So you just take, you can either buy the styrofoam cone, or this is just poster board, 33 cents at Walmart. I rolled it up to kind of resemble a tree. Um, I could have done a better job. But then I, um, and then I, I used scotch tape. And then on the bottom, I used hot glue and put it on a piece of wax paper and put it on a really pretty platter. And then I put um, mini marshmallows around the bottom so you couldn't see that it's hot glued. Um, and don't put your strawberries down there or you can't eat them. <laughs> uh, well, I guess you could if you wanted to. But anyway, um, and then I just start building. Start building from there. I'm doing chocolate dipped strawberries. And then in, I cut off the tops of the strawberries and I'm going to use those just like, you know, sporadically along the way there. Um, but I did paint the uh, poster board with chocolate. This is chocolate, so that way it's not, you know, it doesn't look ugly <laughs> with white shining through. And it's okay if you get a little bit of chocolate on all of your strawberry. That's perfectly fine. Who don't like chocolate strawberries? Me. I don't like chocolate strawberries. And then at the end, I'm going to dust it with some powdered sugar. Oh, girls. I hope it resembles a tree when we're finished. We'll see. So as that chocolate hardens, it's just going to be like a glue. You know what I'm saying? And it's just going to stick right on there. Those tops of strawberries is going to be pretty. Oh, thank you. I always use a fork to dip them in the chocolate. Yeah, I should. I should. But since I have to like splat it onto the tree, <laughs> I don't know if I'm coordinated enough, girl. I don't know. <laughs> I don't like I don't Kathy. I don't like strawberries at all. I don't like strawberries at all. If y'all can believe that, they smell so good and they're so pretty, but I don't like them. I'm not a fan of them. Yeah, um, if I didn't have to just splat it right on there, you know what I'm saying? I could probably use a utensil. Oh no! Are we okay? Did I cut off in my back? We all please like and share. Oh, let that one harden a bit. And like I said, it is okay if you get chocolate on the strawberry because you're going to be covering it with powdered sugar at the end anyway. So it's going to be okay. There was a glitch. Are we back? Are we glitch free now? <laughs> I don't know what happened. I saw that. I saw that. All right, what did I miss? Let me go around. I need one more, don't I? Right there. I'm probably going to have to break out that other container of strawberries. I love strawberries especially. Oh, my gosh, Tracy Hunt. My babies love them, too. They um, came in here last night to visit. <laughs> and they love going to the fridge. Y'all know how that is, going to your grandparents' house. Go to the fridge. Uh, oh, I'm good, Vanessa. Thank you. How are you? But they saw these strawberries cut up in the fridge and they were like, oh my gosh. They came in there with both hands full about 10 times. Was you going to have enough strawberries? <laughs> yeah, I got another um, carton in there. We'll see. If I don't, I really don't know what I'm going to do. I really don't. Unless I cover the top with maybe the leaves of the strawberries and some marshmallows. If I don't have enough. I'm worried about that now. <laughs> now, I'll probably have enough. I believe I will. I hope. I could have made this um, cylinder smaller. I really should have. I didn't realize how big I was making it. Oh, my gosh. But I'm hoping, like I said, I hope mine turns out like hers did because it was so pretty. Um, you could use it as a centerpiece or just on your dessert table or, you know, whatever. Just make it just because I like doing stuff like this. Um, my chocolate's hardening. Just stir it up a little. You can always scatter the strawberries. True. That's true because I'm going to be filling in the holes. That's true. Yes. 
So let's go on around. And like I said, you can do this with anything you want. You can do it with, um, use hot glue or either toothpicks with Hershey Kisses or Reese Cups or anything, but leave them in the package or in arm's reach while lounging on the couch. <laughs> they love going to the fridge. Yep. Them babies love going to the fridge, buddy. Is that what you're talking about, Hannah? <laughs> or make strawberries and then green. Oh, I didn't think about that. That would be pretty. Okay. All right. Let me get this layer done, and I think I'm going to do that. Kathy Runyon, that's a good idea. I'm going to do a row of greenery. Yeah. And then, okay, gotcha. If I have enough, I think I'll have enough. I think I have enough. I did not think about that. Good idea. Thank you, Kathy. <laughs> My hands are getting sticky. Yeah, if not enough. Okay, would y'all please like and share? Let's get some more folks on here. I think this is so fun. I love doing stuff like this, y'all. And again, after we get finished with this, I'm going to do um, that garlic cheese bread. I don't know if you guys have saw me do it before. Um, but I did it on YouTube. Um, and that's another thing. If y'all have not subscribed to my YouTube, if you would do that, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, it's up the hill. That's it. Up the hill on YouTube. Just go over there and subscribe. I have a, a few more videos over there than I do on Facebook. Um, I do too, Kathy. It's going to be pretty no matter what, I think. <laughs> I think no matter what we do, it's going to be pretty. Um, whoa, hold on, <laughs> I'm losing it, I'm losing it, there we go, ah, and see, it's gonna happen, epic fail, <laughs> that's alright, just keep going, right, just keep going, it don't matter, it's still fun, <laughs> I think it's looking pretty. Yeah, I'm going to keep going with some strawberries. Maybe I'll have enough. We'll see. I don't know. That's an awful tall tree. So, again, <clears throat> I don't even know what I started to tell y'all, but um, if you would like and share, let's get some more people on here. Is everybody ready for Christmas? Make a wreath with the strawberry tops. Oh, Marsha, that's a great idea. OMG, yes. <gasps> Make a wreath. Like, okay, like a wreath that stands up or lays down. Let me know. <laughs> Let me know. I got to see it in my head. Hey, everybody. Thanks for joining. We're making an edible strawberry Christmas tree, and it's glued with just chocolate. Just chocolate. Yep. I'm using cardboard. Use some of your berries like Santa hats. <gasps> Shut up. Pamela Clark. That would be pretty. Oh, my gosh. That's a good idea, too. Y'all are coming up with some really good ideas. Really good ideas. My chocolate's hardening. I'm going to have to... Do it again. That is a great... Y'all have got some really good ideas. Great ideas. I don't know what that was. I think it was another leaf off the strawberry. Let me wipe that off because I don't need that. Okay. Oh. Okay. Go on around. Um, so, like, this would be cute for, like I said, just, just because. You don't have to be having a Christmas party. Do it just because. Um, I'm doing snack foods on Christmas Eve. It's what I'm doing, and I don't know. This may be a part of it, but I can tell you right now, this probably won't last through tomorrow, especially if the babies come over. <laughs> or Hannah. They love strawberries. Yeah, I'm going to probably have to melt this chocolate again. 
<laughs> it's Friday night. Everybody's gone. I know this is tedious and it's taken a while, so it's kind of boring, I'm sure. Kind of boring, but the end of it will be pretty. Just wait. Just wait now. Let me try to hurry. Let me try to hurry this. Yeah, I'm going to have to mail this again. Probably. Yep. Let me throw this chocolate in the microwave again because it's um, hardening up. Set a hat on top, then hang your wreath. <gasps> Marsha, that'll be a cute idea. Yes. Let me put this chocolate back in the microwave for just a second. Hello, everybody. Thanks for joining. We are making an edible strawberry Christmas tree. I got to remelt my chocolate. It's kind of hardening up on me. And y'all, this is super cheap to make. Like I said, this is cardboard, or cardboard, poster board, and I just um, slather, slathered it with chocolate, you know, and it's hardened. That way you don't see a big, you know, piece of white sticking through your strawberries. And um, I just melt chocolate and dip the strawberries in it and attach it to it. And it, when the chocolate hardens, it just acts as a glue. And then I've got um, mini marshmallows at the bottom to look like snow, but it'll all come together when it's done. <laughs> and we're trying to figure out a topper. I've had many, many good suggestions. Um, I didn't think about getting a topper for whatever reason. And then we're going to uh, dust it with powdered sugar. I know, Betty Mills. I know, girl. All right, here we go. Oh, that bowl gets hot. Yes. Okay, so I am a lot covered with chocolate, but that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. So it was beginning to harden, so I had to remelt it. I don't mean to shake the table, y'all. Sorry. Sorry. Snowman poop. The more. <laughs> Yeah, there's a little bit of snowman poop in there. <laughs> he just went all around it. He must have had the, the doopsies. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, Lordy. That's funny. <laughs> oh, me. But again, after this, I'm going to... Oh! I'm going to make that, um, I bought a big loaf of the, like the French bread you get in your deli at the store, and I'm going to do that cheesy, buttery, garlicky bread. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about it. And that can um, also be used as um, a party dish. Um, you'll see when we do it, you'll see. And then tomorrow, we're going to be making beef jerky. Oh my gosh beef jerky i know there was a few of you that said you wanted some beef jerky so we're going to make some beef jerky tomorrow and get it to you before christmas what did they use on top they used um of course they had a skinnier top than i do <laughs> they used they put a strawberry on it and then she had a star on a toothpick that she stuck in the strawberry it was so cute but i don't have a star <laughs> I don't have a star. <sighs> well, come on now. It's getting kind of hard to hold these strawberries. My fingers are getting all slickery. It's doing pretty good, though. It's holding pretty good. I'm so excited. Y'all, please like and share. Hashtag strawberry. Oh my goodness, I'm super excited about this. Toothpick with marshmallow for, I don't have any toothpicks. <laughs> Everything y'all name I don't have. I am a sucky chef, ain't I? <laughs> I ain't got nothing in this kitchen. <laughs> I don't have any. Um, a pineapple cut in a star shape would be cute. Brady Pittman, you're so cute. That would have been a great idea, but I don't have any pineapple. <laughs> I don't have nothing. Oh my gosh, I, I suck. 
<laughs> I don't have a matchstick. <laughs> what else could I use? <laughs> what else could I use? Um, I'll figure out something. I'll figure out something. I, I might have foil. I know Kathy. <laughs> Kathy Runyon's like, okay, you're going to try to do a show and ain't got crap to work with, girl. <laughs> I don't. I didn't think it all the way through, did I? Dang. Have any cardboard left? Yeah, I got plenty of cardboard in my shipping stuff. <gasps> I'll figure out something. Got my wheels a turning. My wheels are turning. A Christmas bow. I might have Christmas bows. I might. <laughs> I haven't done a whole lot of shopping, so I haven't bought bows. Y'all. <laughs> oh, bless me. Bless my heart. <laughs> Cut a star out of a Coke box. So oh, Betty Mills, you're so cute. I love that idea. Yes. Betty Mills, we got some mountain to do for you tonight, girl. I can't wait to mount your stuff. Oh, my gosh. I got it in today. A candle small for a birthday cake. I might have one. Let me see. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, bless me. Lord have mercy. I hope I do. I think I might have, actually. I think. I know, Betty Mills. I'm so excited. Oh, my gosh. Your stuff is so pretty. Oh, my gosh. And that pink scarf. That pink scarf is to die for. You're going to love it. You're gonna love it, girl. I'll show you. You have grandchildren. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see if I do. I did have, but I think I took them on their last birthday party for their mommy. But we'll see. I might. Hopefully. Y'all, I'm just so excited that it's staying together. It's going to be so pretty. I'm so excited about it. I was really, really nervous to do it. What, Hannah? Hey, Cheryl. Hannah, what? <laughs> Mom. What, girlfriend? So, if you're just joining, I am making an edible strawberry Christmas tree. An edible strawberry Christmas tree. Hannah, what? <laughs> what? Remember when I was little and I came in y'all room really late? And? <laughs> Continue. What happened? <laughs> what are you talking about? And said, am I still alive? Is my heart beat? <laughs> well, God love you. Yes. Bless your heart. <laughs> Set an ornament on top. Oh, my gosh. Marsha, that's a good idea. I do have plenty of ornaments. <gasps> you saw one done with white chocolate. Cheryl. Oh, my gosh. I bet that was so pretty. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Yep. I bet that was really pretty. Oh, man. Or even drizzled with white chocolate like this. Oh my gosh. Hannah, you're crazy. I love you. <laughs> ah, am I still alive? God love it. Whoa, my chocolate's hardening up again. This is all the chocolate I have to I believe it's going to work out, though, y'all. I believe it is. We all please like and share. Even do it to groups. I don't care. <laughs> if you want to. Hannah, share me. Share me, girl. Thank y'all for joining. If you are just joining, I'm making an edible um, Christmas tree out of strawberries and poster board chocolate um, for your Christmas party or just for... Um, you know, just to snack on. You can just come up, pull on these off, and eat them right off the poster board, of course. I think the, ah! 
Sorry, y'all. Didn't mean to kick the table. Sorry. So sorry. For the fun of it. Yeah, just make it for the fun of it. I love doing stuff like this so much. I really do. And I don't even like strawberries. Um, but I saw somebody else do the <laughs> earthquake. <laughs> but I saw somebody else do this. And so I'm just recreating it the exact same way she did. And it was so pretty. I thought, that would be a good little project just to do for fun with my girls. You're going to do it, Tracy? Yay! It's fun. You just, you know, just sit there and do it. You could even, um, you know, if you wanted to have kind of like a, a party doing this, you, like I said, you can use all different kinds of things um, to do this. It don't have to be strawberries, but that'd be a fun uh, women's party or whatever, you know, building something. Um, I'm just using uh, milk chocolate, but this kind I got out of the wedding section at Walmart. Um, it's the kind they use for like the chocolate fountains. It melts so good and it smells so good. Handcuffs. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Turning out good. What you doing? Almond. Almond bark. Oh my gosh. Yes. That would be good. Put a tad of solid Crisco in it. To, I don't have any. <laughs> Gainella. You know, girl, I ain't got none. <laughs> I ain't got none. Hey, Rhonda. I don't have any Crisco. We don't have no Crisco, do we? No. Well, <laughs> I'm a pitiful mess, ain't I? I ain't got nothing in this kitchen. <laughs> Just the stuff I thought I needed. <laughs> oh, Lord. Y'all gonna be like, Lord bless them, what do they eat? We honestly shop by day. Isn't that a waste? So many trips to the store. We just shop by day. Um, I hope so, Kathy. <laughs> I believe so. We are at the top, girl. We're at the top. <laughs> oh, you came by today, Rhonda? Did you knock? Was we here? We was gone for most of the day. Was the truck here? Well, girl, just let me know next time. That way I'll be sure to be here. I hate I missed you. Dang, Miss Rhonda. It's looking bare. Girl, I ain't done yet. <laughs> the more you hate it, the harder it will get. I work with it a lot. Really, Gaynella? Why does it do that for? Yes, you do, Samantha Irvin. Oh, Lord, that one just didn't stick. Come on now, work with me here. We only got a few more to go. Come on. Come on now. <laughs> Help me. Who said they work with it? Gaynella. <laughs> Oh, the chocolate bowl's looking bare. It is, Kathy. It is. <laughs> it is. Girl. <laughs> Use as little as I can on the rest of these strawberries, y'all. Thanks, Hannah. I'm so nervous. But hey, it's sticking pretty good. I'm so excited. Still got to see what's going on at the top. This video I'm doing is not um, too, too good down here at the bottom. I'm doing another video at the bottom, um, and it's, I don't know, not been able to see it too well, y'all. I'm so sorry. There it is, though. Hey, Alicia, where you been, girl? Where your bottom is so much chocolate and top just a tad, but you can see the strawberries on top. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> but you can see the strawberries on top. Scrape it down and add a tad of oil, but just a tad. Okay. Just a tad of oil. Like, okay, I've got vegetable oil. Gotcha. All right. 
Let me do that. Oh, Lord. That one's not sticking. Come on now. We only got a few more to go. Work with me here now. I do have oil. <laughs> Are y'all so happy? I do have oil. Oh, just a tad. Okay, Ganella. Okay. What's that called? Never seen anything like that before. It's um, just an edible strawberry Christmas tree, and I used um, poster board. I rolled up a poster board. Hold on, I can't mold. Woo, hope that wasn't too much. Um, I just rolled up a poster board and covered it with wax paper and then painted it with chocolate. Oh, God, Ganella. Did you see what I did? I just poured it in. Okay, I think it's going to be good, though. Hey, that's a good little tip, Miss Ganella. That made it smooth again. Oh, thank you, Kathy Runyon. Too much. <laughs> I think I got that at um, like a consignment shop or something. I love those things. Okay. All right. Ooh, we'll see. <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> Girl, if this is killing you, I only got like three strawberries left. <laughs> I do have those left in the, I know, but I don't need that many. I think I'm just going to cover the rest with like the greenery. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Hey, Renee, thanks for joining. Girls, we are making an edible Christmas tree out of strawberries dipped in chocolate. Do you, Ganella? What do you do? Girl, you make candy. Oh, Lord. If you make some candy, I hope you live close. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Let's see. Put this kind of sporadically so I can just add in the greenery and the holes. Hey, hey, girl. Uh... <laughs> I know, Kathy. I know. Hey, I think I can do it. Have a little bit of faith in me. <laughs> I'm going to make it work. Watch here. <laughs> Fingers crossed, y'all. <laughs> That's my school sister I grew up with. Really, Pamela? Well, welcome to the show. Thanks for joining. Girl, this is so cute. And you can do it for just whatever. It doesn't have to be for a Christmas party or whatever. Um, you can do it just, you know, sitting around the house or whatever. Set sitting around the house. What, Rich? Wedding <laughs> Whatever. This is for Christmas. Nervous. I am too, Kathy. Girl, now I've got three. Okay, we got three more, y'all. Kathy, I'm going to do this for you. I'm going to do it. I'm going to make it work. I still don't know what I'm going to do about the top, but I'll figure it out. I don't even know. Oh, my God. That was a little bit too much chocolate. <laughs> Down to two. I do Butterfinger chocolate covered one. <gasps> Ganella, what? Kathy, I'm nervous too, to be honest. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right, here we go. Plop it. <laughs> Just plop it right there. Hope it holds. We will take it. <laughs> Tuck it and go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no. I do have another carton in the fridge, but this is the last strawberry, and I think, I think I'll make it work. <laughs> oh my gosh, Kathy. I think we're going to make it work right here. Oh. Plop it. <laughs> okay, so that. <laughs> Let me wash my hands. Oh my gosh. We still gotta figure out the top. Lord, I got chocolate for days on my hands. Oh gosh, it's everywhere. Oh. Alright. Oh, Where is my towel? Did you take the towel? <laughs> no. Okay, so. Alright. 
You say it looks good? Yeah. <laughs> the granny will be, okay. Oh, thank y'all so much. So this is what it looks like so far. Well, got a big old hole right there. Let's turn it around. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? We're not done yet, y'all. We are not done yet. Hold on, wait a minute. One fell off. What? Shut up, did it really? Did it really? A strawberry fa oh, I see it. Right here it is. Oh no. Yep, right there. Hold on. Hold on. We're just getting him another hot dog, y'all. We had hot dogs with chili and slaw and tater tots. Lord, don't fall off no more, y'all. Stop it. <laughs> okay, let me see. Let me see. Let me think about this. Let me think about this for a second. Hold on. I'll be right back. I'm just seeing, hold on, if it'll go down in there. <gasps> yes, no, maybe so? What do you think? Yes, no, maybe so? I ain't done yet, though. Oh, it's too big? Oh, man, dang it. Too big. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> okay, hold on. All right, let me go find something else. <laughs> hold on. Now listen. We will you now wait a minute. I got some other stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, but I got this. Let's see. Don't listen to me, I'm just pretty much Oh Kathy, no! I want it to look good. I don't think that'll work. Hey, I asked for y'all's opinions. That's what that's what you're giving me. I think I'm out of options. <laughs> I'm gonna have to use it. I'm gonna have to use it. The snowflake. Okay, I'm gonna use the snowflake. But before I use the snowflake, I'm gonna go ahead and put in my greenery and the powdered sugar. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! <laughs> the snowflake. Okay, gotcha. We'll do the snowflake. Okay, so again, this is just the tops off the strawberries, and I'm just going to plug them in um, wherever we need greenery and hope they stay. <laughs> use it. Okay, good. I'm going to use it. Okay. And like I said, I'm just going to put these sporadically throughout the tree. Sporadically. That's my other big word for the day. <laughs> What rich is he? You could use mint leaves for this. The snowflake. Gotcha. I am using the snowflake. Um, you could use mint leaves. Like I said, you don't have to use the tops off the strawberries, but I don't plan on eating the leaves anyway, so just pick those off if you don't want them. <laughs> just pick them off if you don't want them. <gasps> oh, God. Is it leaning? I don't think so. I don't think it is. I hope not. Oh my gosh. Kathy Runyon, you got me a nervous wreck. I don't think it is. 
<laughs> if it is, we will just uh, go with it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think I'm going to use um, some more marshmallows too. No! <laughs> Kathy, run. You know I'm giving you all our time. It's okay, girl. Oh, no! <laughs> I thought I dropped them. No! <laughs> Put a stick in it and prop it up. Yeah. My goodness. Well, there's the doggies. Some marshmallow treats. Um, I'm going to stick these in a hole, too, if they'll stay. I don't know if they'll stay. We'll see. I believe they're going to stay. Y'all, I am so excited about this. Oh, my gosh. Is it making it pop? Oh, my gosh. Yes, I'm so excited. I wonder if I could take, like, a big ball of this and stick it right here. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see about that. I might still use the snowflake. Cause, no, that ain't going to work. Because that's a big old hole and it's going to go right down in there. Dang it. <laughs> Y'all, I'm super excited about this. It's falling out. Stop it. <laughs> Stop falling out. So do you think this might be something y'all want to do? Heart rate is at mine too. Kathy, oh my gosh, tell me about it. This thing falls over, I'm just going to die. Anybody like that, huh? No. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, let's see there. You got any cool? No, Pam. Dang, I don't. <laughs> I don't. I'm fixing to cover it with powdered sugar. Um, but that would have been cute. I could have put it in there. Oh, my gosh. Y'all have such... Oh, wow. <laughs> Sorry, slippery. Slickery when wet. Y'all have such good ideas. Oh, my gosh. That stra strawberry's going to fall. No, 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 no. <gasps> oh. The strawberry just fell. Kathy, I don't have, I got hot dogs and chili. <laughs> Just what we uh, eat for supper. I'm telling you, we only shop on like a day-to-day -day basis. We're pitiful. We're pitiful. <laughs> oh, Lordy. We actually got um, a few steaks and stuff today. Cause we're going to do beef jerky tomorrow. So, I hope y'all can watch that. We're going to do beef jerky tomorrow. That's going to be fun. We've already got it cut up and marinating. Um, what did you use? A ribeye? That ain't going to work. <laughs> I don't know. He didn't hear me, I guess. All right. Did you see the mustard? <laughs> hey, I've got all kinds of marshmallows and strawberries in the floor. I do. I do. Oops. We got some tater tots. We got tater tots, y'all. Okay, now I am going to use my powdered sugar to dust this tree. <clears throat> oh, and snowman poopy, yes. <laughs> You want to make one, Evelyn? Oh, my God, they're so fun. I mean, I've had a ball just sitting here doing it. Just sitting here doing it. That is pretty, but if I was there, I would probably have. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my gosh, Dawn. Okay, so I've got my powdered sugar in um, a little sifter. I probably could have used a smaller one. So, um, here we go. Snowing. 
It's snowing. Oh my gosh, I believe it is leaning. Shut up. Ah. <laughs> well, let's just hurry so we can kind of just scoot out of here. Excuse me. <laughs> We're doing a pork roast for pulled pork sandwiches. Coleslaw Paula, that's my favorite. I love barbecue. Okay, and make sure you get plenty of this powdered sugar on your platter as well because we want it to look like it's snowing and not all kinds of um, <laughs> chocolate down there. But whatever, whatever. Let me get the chocolate ones out of the way because we want it to look like snow and not chocolate. So hold on. <laughs> hey, it's the first time I've done this and it's been so fun. I'm not even kidding. But again, make sure you get a lot of powdered sugar on your platter so it looks like snow. And then we're going to put that top on. Let me put a little bit <laughs> right here where that strawberry fell off. I'm just throwing throwing it on there. Bam! <laughs> You're allergic to strawberries, Dawn? Oh my gosh. Now, you know what? I don't even like strawberries. Table and plate. Yes, get it everywhere. Everywhere. Get the get the powdered sugar everywhere, honey. That's what makes it so fun. <laughs> okay, so I'm just using a uh, ornament. Just using an ornament. So let me show this video down here. Here we go, y'all. I know this video's not been really good down here, and you've not been able to see too much. Um, but I hope you're um, enjoying it. I need a little bit more powdered sugar on this side. Hold on. <laughs> I need it like in those little crevices too. <laughs> you know, you get the gist. Okay. That's good, I believe. Enjoying. <laughs> Isn't it cute? I have it all over the floor. I seriously do. But this is so cute, y'all. So, well, they're going to piece of greenery. So I'm just going to use the uh, snowflake for the top like y'all said. O M to the G. Here it is. <gasps> Here it is y'all. This was so fun. Look at this. Oh my gosh. And it is totally edible. You've got your little marshmallows in there, your strawberries, your chocolate, your um, powdered sugar. Oh, I think it is so pretty. It's leaning. Whoa, now. Don't be leaning. Oh, my gosh. I'm super excited about it. Oh, my gosh. It's so pretty. <laughs> but it's leaning. But it is um, hot glued to a piece of parchment paper. And the parchment paper is glued um, in the center to the tray. And so I don't think it'll fall over, I hope. <laughs> So, what a cute piece for your Christmas dinner, your Christmas party, or just if it's, um, you know, you and your immediate family at home gathering for Christmas or whatever. Um, and you can do this. <laughs> I've got powdered sugar all over me. Um, thank you, Evelyn. Thank you, Kathy. Thank y'all so much. Thank you, Pam. Um, but you can make this for, um, you know, whatever. Just sitting around, eat you some chocolate-covered strawberries. Hey, Kathy Wyatt. I missed it. It's with just chocolate. Just milk chocolate. I melted some milk chocolate, Miss Kathy Wyatt. And it's, um, as it hardens, you know, it acts like a glue. And my cylinder is actually just um, poster board wrapped in wax paper. Or you can buy the styrofoam one. You know, it's up to you. Um, and wrap it in wax paper if you want to. Um, but this is just... I could have made it a little bit more Christmas tree shaped, but um, I think this is so pretty. I'm super excited. I can't even sit down. <laughs> Thank you, Jamie. Thank you, Kathy White. But again, that'll be really good for, you know, your dessert table at Christmas dinner or your Christmas party or just because. This one is just because um, my family will eat this up. Um, but on the poster board, Miss Kathy White, um, I did paint it with chocolate as well, the melted chocolate. That way you're not seeing white poster board through the strawberries, you know. I'm breathing hard because I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm 
getting hopped up. Uh, but we're not done. I mean, I understand if y'all have to get up, or get up, get off of here, but I'm about to make some cheesy bread. Cheesy bread. That'd be another good thing for your... <laughs> I need a bag. <laughs> I need one of those bags to breathe in. <gasps> but we're about to make some cheesy bread, which will also um, go great for your Christmas dinner because of the way that it's going to look. It's going to have the green and the red um, in it. She said, let's go. Y'all ready? Woo! <laughs> I might have to go in here and take a break. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> this, I am so excited. Hannah, are you still on here? You have a paper bag. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> I need one, don't I? But I'm so excited. Oh, my gosh. And look at the bottom. And the way it looks like snow. If it, if it fell over, I would die. What? Oh. So, there it is. Okay, y'all, I will be right back. So, um, I'm going to cut, not y'all, don't listen to me on here. I am going to um, cut off this video and start a new one. You know it. Um, so, thank y'all for joining me for the edible strawberry Christmas tree. Um, I hope you decide to make this for your holidays, your Christmas dinner, or what have you, or whatever. <laughs> um, but I will be back in just a minute with a new video for the cheesy bread.